Hi all! Good to see you on my The Famous Room channel. My name is Max. I wish you all a good day. Today we are going to discuss with you how Amy Roloff reported that she was tricked into selling the farm to Matt. As I understand it, Amy is being challenged about her ex-husband. She was in the spotlight on last Tuesday night's new episode of Little People Big World and talked about Matt's recent decision to sell his farm in Oregon. Matt revealed the secret to us all back in May. He then revealed that the 16 acres were now up for sale, that the decision to sell was scary but also exciting, and added, it's time to move toward the next season of life. Tori and Zack Roloff were very outraged after this statement from Matt and have since made statements that they expect to buy the property someday. Zack accused his father of cowardice and manipulation for all to see on Instagram. And so, we see that Amy announced a possible sale this week. As soon as she heard that the farm would go to some stranger, she expressed regret that she took herself out of the equation when she sold her piece to Matt in 2019. Leaving the farm was a very hard choice and decision for me, she explained on air. But you know, in the back of my mind and everything else, I had hoped that maybe it would go to one of the kids. You know, they'd be able to negotiate with Matt and one of them would buy it. During dinner with a friend, she called everything going on a sad topic. Amy said she felt pressure from Matt while negotiating her deal. I could have stuck it out for more money and said, BS man, she lamented. But I was hoping by selling him the farm I would make it more palatable that maybe one of the kids. I had no inkling what is happening now. It blows me away. Matt tried to argue that both Jeremy and Zag had been offered solid offers to sell the farm, but they each chose to move rather than buy it. Zack and Tori now live in Washington, D.C., and Jeremy and Andre just bought their farm. It will be sad to see a for sale sign because it's not going to any of my kids, it's going to a stranger, Amy added in a confessional on Tuesday. The dynamics of the family will change. We all know this isn't the first time Amy has spoken out against Matt's proposed sale. In a previous conversation with Us Weekly, she said she thought Matt should take a higher road with Zack. I don't know a lot of the details of the negotiation that went on between Zack and Matt, she told this tabloid. Matt is still the father, still the adult. I don't care how old your kids are, sometimes there are things that may need to learn, but you know, as an adult, as a father, you may have to take the higher road. I'm just sad that it's come to this. Parts of me are not exactly surprised because I've dealt with Matt over the years and he can be tough. Thank you all for watching, see you all soon. Don't forget to subscribe to the channel and put a bell on it.